Hello there everybody, welcome to Press Break Red Button, I'm Zane, and I'm actually doing a tutorial video today. Um, I have it all set up, I have everything all set up, I was just doing some testing, I was in the, and forget it, I need an altar. There it goes, there's the power. Oh, the power! Uh, these are infinity eggs, which is basically creative world altar, especially. Gives you all the power. All of it. I, I'm dead serious, all the power. <laughs> it's amazing. Uh, let's see. Uh, dragon eggs, but better. Infinitely better. Alright, so I have my base cauldron set up. Um, now, I'm doing this for another YouTuber. The, the YouTuber's name is Chilm, and he's an amazing YouTuber. I love his videos. They're just amazing to me. I watch every single one of them that comes out, but he was having a little bit of trouble figuring out why his sugar wouldn't work um, with this. And he did this test um, where you throw mandrake and then sugar in, right? And it should let it go. But it won't go into the cell. And the reason is not because of your expertise. The guy does a really bad job exper uh, ex basically explaining expertise. Inexperienced wishes are not so proficient in actually bottling a brew. To obtain more brews from a cauldron, practice is needed, eventually requiring more complex brews to be made. And he's even tried this, you know, making more complex brews. And also wearing the correct clothing also helps. Um, the type of brews you can brew is not based on expertise. That's more like the more witching bodily you do, um, the more brews you can get like out of a cauldron. Um, so, sugar is a level two effect, and I'll show you this. Um, and it's fast moving. Um, you need an altar for power he knows that I'm just saying that for people at home who don't know why the heck that's right there um, but capacity in a brew is a very important part. now throwing in a mandrake will give it one capacity giving it another one will give it two more capacity um, now the level is actually important so level two items all of these have a level two effect um, or, or rather a level two effect costs two capacity so if you throw in the nether wart then and then the sugar you can see we just made the potion um, and we just bottled it and got a brew of speed hold on earth was that up there and see speed well you would be able to see speed uh go into game mode s yes and and i'm gonna show that it has nothing really to do with creative mode by just kind of doing it again if i go this this oh yeah okay that took it uh, throw in some glowstone dust for some extra power, why not? Throw in the sugar. Bottle. Potion of speed too. Woohoo. And this extends for just about anything. Um, your level isn't dependent on what kind of brews you can make. Um, you can even go all the way up to the highest tier brew, which if I remember correctly, let's actually make it just to kind of show, show my point. Um, Capacity. I'm gonna need Mandrake, Nether Warp, Tier of Goddess, Diamond Vapor, Diamond, Nether Star. You got it. Uh, let's see. Tier. Diamond. Diamond 2. Diamond Vapor. Nether Star. Um, why is it so dark? Oh, maybe because. Time set day. There we go. That's nicer. Um, but yeah, you have to add these in ingre or ingredients in an order. I'm going to make sure that. Ta, 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 ta. Um, yes. Good, good, good. And then we just add those. Add them. Doop, 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 doop. So yeah, this does require killing over there. And then we add in the piece de resistance. I know, weird effect, right? And this should um, summon the shade of Leonard, although maybe the uh, power doesn't have enough, altar doesn't have enough power. Um, or is my game mode set to peaceful? Hold on, let me check that. Um, difficulty is normal now, so that wouldn't be it. Uh, let's put down some chalk. Why not? Uh, chalk. Uh, 
I did something really odd because it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And let's try this again then, shall we? I know I did that right, Dan. Oh, hold on. Oh, there it goes. Never mind. Yeah, you can see it's spinning. And there he is, Shade of Leonard. Right, didn't just have just didn't have enough sufficient ultra power. So yes, um, so yes, uh, Chilm, there's your answer. It's not that you are insufficiently skilled in the cauldron. Um, you're just not adding enough effect modifiers to your burrows. Um, so yeah, you can do them. You can do any any size potion you want. Any of them. Any of them. Any I say. Actually, I'm gonna do one right now just because I, I like showing this off. Do, 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 do. Um, oh no, I need this. So it's do 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 do, and I'm just gonna dime it up. Why not? Glowstone. Oh wait, did I want it? Nah, it's alright. Um, emerald. This makes a fun brew that I love. Level seven, I think. Yes. And now, I become tiny. So yes, this is a brew of resizing too, and the brew of resizing I love. I'm just gonna show off a couple of these just because I'm love them. <laughs> uh, let's see, it's a level. Was it level eight then? Level six, yes, resizing. So it actually shows you what size you're gonna shrink down to. Level one, you're gonna get half your size, like a quarter of your size. You're gonna be so tiny; it's not even funny. Uh, <laughs> you can't even jump up blocks. It is a perfect trolling potion uh, on servers. And then if you get like the biggest one, you become like huge, monstrous. Idiot. You grow to twice your size, even though that is expensive as crib. Uh, I think it also like gives you a little bit debuffs, and you can even it even works on boss mobs here. Um, and so, actually, I'm going to show you this. I really want to show you this because it might help out with your uh, little problem you've been having there with a certain huntsman, if you know who I'm talking about. So it's. Oh wait, gotta wait to go. Crap. Uh, I'm an idiot and broke. Threw him in the wrong water. Okay. Okay, I'll just save that there for now. And and where's my there? And my brew of endless water is there. There we go. Okay. So I know that'll work, and then I actually want to make it a uh, splash. So I need some. Let's see, globe, globe. I'm showing this off on the regrowth. Uh, so by the way, some, some of that. Uh, we don't want to use that. Instead, we just. I think right now we want to bottle it. Oh no, because I'm an idiot and didn't even add in the effect. Oh no, gosh, thank you. Give me all that. Oh um, my, see, I'm even derpier than he is. Like, if you like this derp, you'll love him. Um, and then, globe. Emerald. Emerald. No, did I derp again? Dang it. That makes him explode. No worries about the explosion. He's just over there having a grand old time. Okay. Da, 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 da. Go to the diamond vapor. Heck, let's just throw it all in for safety's sake. Okay, then we want to do a dispersal of this. And none of that, that, and yes, and so you'll see what this does to him. Hello, tiny man. 
It's so tiny. It only lasts for like an instant, but it's so cool. Look at him go. He's really oh my gosh, it's adorable. Hey there, little fella. And then he's back to real size. So yeah, that might help with your huntsman problem. Or it might not, but yeah. So there's your answer on how to create all the brews. Um, it's not a creative mode thing. I've tested this in like single player worlds and dang it, was it a pain in the butt. Uh, but yeah, that should fix your problem. Alright, Tim. Hey, best of luck on that Horned Huntsman. <laughs> it it's, uh, can be a real pain. I, I recommend... Uh, <clears throat> I recommend a certain potion effect. Uh, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Where's the demon vein? Uh, I recommend <clears throat> wink, wink, nudge, nudge, demon vein. Just saying. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna be all for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, channel, I hope you see this, and I hope it helps you out with your problems. Uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. Whenever the heck I get around to finding out what I want to do with the channel. Because, uh, it's been non... Not a lot of inspiration. But, I'm still here. I'm still trying to make videos. It's just nothing's really coming to mind about what I want to do. I still gotta up upload regrowth, but I'll get to that once I find out my next project. Because that kind of takes pro president. Making sure that I have some good content coming out on the channel. Bye, guys. Have a good one and stay crazy.